first question we ask everybody who come on the show is uh, when you first made it to the NBA, who was the first person to bust your ass? Man, uh, I'm gonna keep this real with y'all, man. My ass got busted real early, man. I came into the league, man, I was in the <laughs> right team. Um, you know, you know how some of them vets, man, they play you to the team, man. I got played down in Boston one night. We was playing uh, Boston Celtics. So the great Larry Bird, I didn't really know much about it. You know, I'm from Indiana, Larry's from Indiana. I knew about the history of Larry, but I didn't realize how he really got down. <laughs> When we got to when we got when we got to Boston that morning, I knew someone right. I saw an X Man. He was limping around the court a little bit, like he was sore. I figured he'd be all right, you know. Xavier McDaniel. Xavier McDaniel. I figured he'd be all right by that time. I go to the game on the early bus. I get there. They come out on the court. They say, "Hey, Sean, uh, you starting the night against uh, Larry?" And I was like, well, damn. Okay. <laughs> "I'm all for it, though, you know." So. um the X Man, he didn't play. He had a sore knee. But my point to you is this: uh, Larry gave me, he gave me, uh, he gave me fifty and three quarters. Oh my! <laughs> oh, he, was, he, was, he, was, he was hitting everything, man, and he talked to me the whole entire game. He what did he say? He do. Well, first of all, he asked me to jump ball. He said, "You the cat that broke all my records in high school, right?" And I was like, "Yeah, that's me." He goes, "Yeah, you the one that used to." Jump my brother too, right? Now, Eddie. And I was like, yeah, that's me. Oh. He said, I got you for you tonight. So every shot he was calling, at the defensive end, he would tell me, he'd be like, when I get down to the other end, I'm going to pump face you, get a oh. hand one on you, <laughs> look at you, <laughs> pull off the glass. That's how cold Larry yeah. Bird was. And this, that's mm. the legend. Like, people say that he was one of the dirtiest trash talking, one of the best trash talkers, like the one game he played and told dude, I'm going to shoot all left-hand buckets on you. Okay. So he really talked like that. You know, so, you know, being from the streets, man, I was to the point of like, look, I'm going to foul him so hard that he's going to, he's basically going to take his will. He started shooting the ball with his left hand, man. I, I was trying to foul, foul his right arm. He was shooting with his left hand, banking it off on me, looking at me, still slapping me on my butt and everything, man, tell me everything. <laughs> you know what I'm now, see, that's something that he didn't hit you. He like, he didn't hit you on the butt. Now, now I got to fight you. <laughs> <laughs> and then Larry, uh, he actually invited me to his house that summer after the game, man. He told me, he said, that's the best defense I've seen so far as the best effort. I get you. Yeah. Because you yeah, still compete. You still quarters, compete. But that was the best effort I've seen in a long time. Uh, you know, you come to the house yeah. and shoot around with me. There's something I show you how to shoot the ball, young fella. Larry Legend. Straight up. <laughs> All right, well, 